Hello, this will be a new series where I read Wikipedia. If you have any ideas for Wikipedia pages you want me to read, link them in the Discord, which will be down below. Anyway, let's get into reading this. This one is Pug. Yeah, alright. The Pug is a breed of dog distinguished by a wrinkly, short, muzzled face and curled tail. The breed has a fine, glossy coat that comes in a variety of colours, most often light brown, fawn, or black, and a compact square body with well-developed muscles. Pugs were brought from China to Europe in the 16th century and were popularised in Western Europe by the House of Orange of the Netherlands and the House of Stuart. In the United Kingdom in the 19th century, Queen Victoria developed a passion for pugs, which she passed on to other members of the royal family. Pugs are known for being sociable and gentle companion dogs. The American Kennel Club describes the breed's personality as even temp tempered and charming. Pugs remain popular into the 21st century with some famous celebrity owners. A pug was judged best in show at the World Dog Show in 2004. Description Physical character I can't even read. Physical characteristics while the pugs that are depicted in 18th century prints tend to be long and lean, modern breed preferences are for a square cobby body and a compact form, a deep chest and well-developed muscle. Their smooth and glossy coats can be fawn, apricot fawn, silver fawn or black. The markings are clearly defined and there is a trace of a black line extending from the occiput, I don't know how that's word said, to the tail. The tail normally curls tightly over the hip. Pugs have two distinct shapes for their ears, rows and button. Rose ears are smaller than the standard style of button ears and are folded with the front edge against the side of the head. Breeding preferences go to button style ears. Pugs legs are strong, straight and of moderate length and are set well under. Their shoulders are moderately laid back, their ankles are strong, their feet are small, their toes are well split up, and their nails are black. The lower teeth normally protrude further than their upper, resulting in an underbite. Temperament This breed is often described by the Latin phrase, multum in parvo, or much in little, or a lot of dog in a small space. Alluding to the pug's remarkable and charming personality, despite its size, pugs are strong-willed but rarely aggressive and are suitable for families with children. The majority of the breed is fond, very fond of children and sturdy enough to properly play with them. Depending on the owner's mood, they can be quiet and docile, but also vivacious and teasing. Pugs tend to be intuitive and sensitive to the moods of their owners and are usually eager to please them. Pugs are playful and thrive on human companionship. They also tend to have a snoozy nature and spend a lot of time napping. Pugs are often called shadows because they follow their owners around and like to stay close to the action, craving attention and affection from their owners. Birth and Reproduction Pug pregnancies last an average of 63 days. The average size litter for pugs is 4 to 6 puppies though these can vary from 1 to 9 and still be considered normal. This first picture. The breed has strong straight legs set well under the body and a tail that curls over the hip. Second picture. Purebred pugs are known for their unique facial wrinkles. Third picture. Eyes should be large with rounded shape and dark in colour. Fourth picture. Fawn is the most common colour for a pug but the American Kennel Club also recognizes the color black. The Canadian Kennel Club recognizes the colors black, silver, apricot, and fawn. History. Chinese origins. China is the earliest known source for the breed. Similar dogs were popular in the imperial court during the Song Dynasty. In ancient times, pugs were bred to be companions for ruling families in China. The pet pugs were highly valued by Chinese emperors and the royal dogs were kept in luxury and guarded by soldiers. 
Pugs later spread to other parts of Asia. In Tibet, Buddhist monks kept pugs as pets in their monasteries. The breed has retained its affectionate devotion to its owners since ancient times, 16th and 17th centuries. Pugs were popular at European courts and reportedly became the official dogs of the House of Orange in 1572. After a pug named Pompey, Pompey saved the life of the Prince of Orange by altering him to the approach of assassins. Alerting, not altering, I can't read. Alerting him to the approach of assassins. A pug travelled with William III, William III, and Mary II when they left the Netherlands to accept the throne of England in 1688. During this period, the pug may have been bred with the old type King Charles Spaniel, giving the modern King Charles Spaniel its pug characteristics. This first picture, William Hogarth, 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 either way, with his pug Trump in 1745. 18th century, no, we're not there yet, are we? No, we're here. The breed eventually became popular in European countries, other European countries as well. Pugs were painted by Goya in Spain and in Italy. They rode up front on private carriages, dressed in jackets and pa pantaloons. They matched those of the coachman. They were used by the military to track animals and people. and were also employed as guard dogs. 18th century to present day. The English painter William Hogarth, Hogarth was the devoted owner of a series of pugs. His 1745 self-portrait, which is now in London's Tate Gallery, includes his pug Trump. The pug was also well known in Italy in 1789. Author Hester Piozzi wrote in her journal, The little pug dog or Dutch mastiff has quitted London for Padua, I perceive. Every carriage I meet here has a pug in it. The popularity of the pug continued to spread to France during the 18th century before her marriage to Napoleon Bonaparte. Josephine had her pug fortune carry concealed messages to her family while she was confined at Les Carmes prison. In having a loan being given visiting rights. rights. 19th century England, the breed flourished under the patronage of Queen Victoria. Her many pugs, which she bred herself, including Olga, Pedro, Minka, Fatima, and Venus. Her involvement with dogs in general helped to establish the Kennel Club, which was formed in 1873. Queen Victoria favored, favored apricot and fawn pugs. Queen Victoria's passion for pugs was passed on to many other members of the royal family including her grandson, King George V, and his son, King Edward VIII. Many responded to the breed's image of anti-functionalism and diminutive size during this period. In paintings and engravings of the 18th and 19th centuries, pugs usually appear with longer legs and noses than today, and sometimes with cropped ears the modern pug's appearance probably changed after 1860 when a new wave of pugs were imported directly from China. These pugs had shorter legs and the modern style pug nose. The British aristocrat, Lady Bra Bracy, Brassy, Brassy, is credited with making black pugs fashionable after she brought some back from, the, from, from China in 1886. Ear cropping was made illegal in 1895. Pugs arrived in the United States during the 19th century and were soon making their way into the family home and the show ring. The American Kennel Club recognized the breed in 1885. The Pug Dog Club of America was founded in 1931 and was recognized by the American Kennel Club that same year. In 1981, the Pug Dandy's favorite woodchuck won Westminster Kennel Club Dog Show in the United States. The only pug to have won there since the show began in 1877. The world champion or best in show at 2004 World Dog Show held in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil was a pug named Double D Cineblue's Masterpiece. Health Problems 
Since pugs lack longer snouts and prominent skeletal brow ridges, they are susceptible to eye injuries such as proptosis, scratch corneas, and painful antropion. They have also have compact breathing passageways, leaving many prone to breathing difficulties or unable to efficiently regulate their temperature through evaporation from the tongue by panting. A pug's normal body temperature is between 101 degrees Fahrenheit, 38 degrees Celsius, and 102 degrees Fahrenheit, 39 degrees Celsius. This temperature rises to 105 degrees Fahrenheit, 41 degrees Celsius. Oxygen demand is greatly increased in, increased, and immediate cooling is required. If body temperature reaches 108 degrees Fahrenheit, 42 degrees Celsius, organ failure can occur. Their breathing problems can be worsened by the stresses of traveling in air cargo, which may involve high temperatures following the deaths of pugs and other brachycephalic breeds. Several airlines either banned their transport and cargo or enacted seasonal restrictions. Pugs that live a mo mostly sedentary life can be prone to obesity, though this is avoidable with regular exercise and a healthy diet. Median lifespan of pugs is 11 years, which is in line with other breeds of the same size. Common Conditions Pugs, like other short-snouted breeds, have elongated palates. When excited, they are prone to reverse sneezing, which causes them to quickly and seemingly, seemingly, seemingly laboriously gasp and snort. The veterinary name for this is oh God, pharyngeal gag reflex, and it is caused by fluid or debris getting caught under the palate and irritating the throat or limiting breathing. Reverse sneezing episodes are usually not harmful, and massaging the dog's throat or covering its nose in order to make it breathe through its mouth can often shorten a sneezing fit. Some pugs are also born with stenotic nares, which can also inhibit their breathing. In serious cases, the pinched nostrils make breathing even more difficult for this breed and put added pressure on the larynx. In some cases, the dog could pass out from blocked airways. If this happens, one should inquire with their veterinarian, veterinarian whether or not surgery is needed to modify the breathing passages. Eye prolapse is a common problem among pugs and other brachycephalic breeds, see brachycephalic airway obstructive syndrome, and can be caused by a trauma to the head or neck or even by the owner using a tight leash instead of a harness. While the eye can usually be pushed back into a socket by the owner or a vet, veterinary attention is usually advisable. If the prolapse happens on a regular basis, the pug might require surgery. Pugs have many wrinkles in their faces, so owners will often clean inside the crease to avoid irritation and infection. If this is not done, the dog may develop a condition known as skinfold dermatitis. An abnormal formation of the hip socket known as hip dysplasia affected nearly 64% of pugs in the 2010 survey performed by the Orthopedic Foundation for Animals. The breed was ranked the second worst affected by this condition out of 157 breeds tested. Pugs are one of several breeds that are more, more susceptible than other dogs to demodectic mange, mange, also known as demodex. This condition is caused when parasitic mites that are often present in a dog's skin without causing symptoms are allowed to do damage because their host has a weakened immune system. It is a problem for many young, young pugs, although not usually a major one and is easily treatable, but some are especially susceptible and present with a systemic form of the condition. This vulnerability is thought to be generic and breeders will avoid producing puppies from adults who have this condition. In 2008, an investigative documentary carried out by the BBC found significant inbreeding between pedigree dogs, with a study by Imperial College London showing that the 10,000 pugs in the UK were so inbred that their gene pool was the equivalent of only 50 individuals. <laughs> Serious issues. Pugs can suffer from 
necrotizing meningocephalitis enemy also known as pug dog and cephalitis PDE an inflammation of the brain and menin menings meninges I, I don't know anyway enemy also occurs in other small dogs such as the Yorkshire Terrier Maltese and Chihuahua there is no known cure for enemy which is believed to be an inherited disease dogs usually die or have to be put to sleep within a few months of onset which in those susceptible to this condition is mostly between six months and three years of age this breed along with other braxphalic dogs example boxers bulldogs are also prone to hemivertebrae 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 hemivertebrae, hemivertebrae? either way Hemivertebrae is what we're going to call it. Hemivertebrae. The curled tail of a British Bulldog is an example of a hemivertebrae, but when it occurs not in the... I don't know how to say that word. Coccygeal vertebrae, but in other areas of the spine, it can cause paralysis. The condition occurs when two parts of a spinal vertebra do not fuse properly while a young pug is still growing, resulting in an irregularly shaped spinal cavity which can put pressure on the spinal cord. Let's go back through these pictures. Picture two of this one. A portrait of Princess Ekaterina Dmitrievna Golitsna by Louis Mikhail van Lu. 1759 Moscow Pushkin Museum Final of Fine Art Pushkin Museum of Fine Arts. Picture three, a favorite pug female dog depicted in 1802 by Henry Bernard Chalon. <laughs> Picture four, an overweight pug. <laughs> oh, I love it. Historical depictions of pugs. Picture one, a Dutch Mastiff called Old Virtue with Dunham Maisie in the background. Jan Wick, 1700. Children of the Marquis de Bethune with a pug. A male pug, 1802. Picture 4. Portrait of Sylvie de la Rue, circa 1810. Picture 5. Young lady in a boat with a pug by James Tissot, 1870. Picture 6. Engraving of the pugs Punch and Punch and Petty from the 1859 book, The Dog in Health and Disease. Pug from 1915. Pug photo. Circa 1900. Note the small head and the long legs it has. And the last picture, a pug by Karl Reichert. Reichert. 1836 to 1918. In popular culture. The breed became iconic in India, as it was featured as the mascot in a series of Vodafone, formerly Hutchinson SR, advertising commercials directed by Prakash Varma. The pug that was predominantly featured in the commercials was Chika. The advertisement campaign was followed by a rise in the popularity of pugs in India, and the sale of pugs more than doubled within months, with prices for pugs rising considerably. A few other adverts also appeared in the following month, inspired by the idea of a dog following a boy. The Men in Black film series features Frank the Pug, a, a fictional talking pug played by the animal actor Mushu. Frank has helped to popularize pugs and has become an iconic example of the breed. See also Molossa, Companion Dog, Lap Dog, and Order of the Pug. And these are all the references on. They're not important to pugs as much as this actual Wikipedia page. And that's that. So if you enjoyed, like, subscribe, share. Commenting is the most important part though. But like, subscribe and share. Um, Discord link is in the description if you have any more Wikipedia pages you want me to read. Um, and that's it. I will see all of you next time. Bye.